you guys and girls it's ryan with practice makes perfection.com thanks for tuning into this video today i wanted to show you guys a trick that i did to turn my spoil board into just a, a regular board that's right you heard correct i'm out here saving the spoil boards people before i get started i need your help achieving the american dream of becoming a household youtube personality by hitting the subscribe button and of course signing up for my all-in-one stock drop shipping youtube and real estate investing mogul course i'm of course being sarcastic but subscribing would mean the world to me cue the intro and let's get this started So what I ended up doing was uh, drilling out a hole in the top of the little plate that hits the limit switch. That way uh, I can just kind of set, you know, the end of my bit onto whatever the bottom is. Uh, I guess what you could say a spoil board. And it pretty much will set it so that it hits the limit switch if it reaches the spoil board. So pretty simple pretty easy I can just adjust it if I'm using a thicker material or anything like that or propping it up um, the way I have my table set up and everything like that is totally different than the normal machine so I thought it was handy what I also did was uh, due to my laser upgrade I uh, if I raise my z-axis up too far the laser is gonna hit the little bracket that the axis is on so I went ahead and put a, a screw on the bottom as well as you can see right there it stops it from going up any further it goes ahead and hits that uh, Z switch there and that's really it really easy um, just gives me some more uh, flexibility with my adjustments Anyways, that was all. Real simple, real quick. Appreciate you guys checking this out. Take it easy. See you guys next time.